All right, this should be interesting. I always like videos like this. So this is Messi's inside Messi's Porsche tower with supercar elevator. Interesting. Shout out to Supercar Blondie. I like her videos. My wife introduced me to the channel because you know this is like my kind of style. I love these different cars and luxury style places, boats, so on and so forth. Um, but yeah, this one's I did a Porsche Tower. And shout out to Messi. Shout out to the a legend. Um, but Porsche Tower with Supercar Elevator. This should be real interesting. Let's not have a long intro. Let's get right into it. I'll make sure to put the original video in the description below. This should be really interesting. Never heard of something like this before. That's why I like watching these videos. This building was designed in collaboration with Porsche. Over 22 billionaires live here. One of them, the greatest footballer of all time. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll put it up here for now and see what happens. This building was in collaboration with Porsche. Over 22 billionaires live here. One of them, the greatest footballer of all time, Messi. This place is all about 22 cars. billionaires, a wow. elevator downstairs. The cars up here are already crazy. The ones downstairs, even crazier. This is the world's first Porsche tower. It has its own What's that, in Miami? elevator. And like I said, has residents like Lionel Messi and Maluma. Condos here start from four and a half million dollars and go all the way up to 35 million for the tower penthouse. Wow. We're gonna take our Porsche in the elevator to the 42nd floor. Yeah, let me see that, that's cool. <laughs> elevator for your car. Two in Miami. That's sick. Oh, it is all Miami, right, okay. I was about to say, it looked like Miami. In my little glass Makes circle. sense, it's a messy place for Miami. So I have a little sign that tells me to stop. And, and this thing is spinning by itself. I mean, uh, ah, okay, to align with the elevator door. Okay, I see. So basically, I just stop. I don't even have to reverse. The Deservator is a unique and fully automated car elevator designed for the residents to park directly inside their sky garages. Kind of like their own supercar showroom in their house. Each unit can hold between two and 11 cars, and there are three Deservators in total. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. back up. What is there? How many cars? Their sky garages. Kind of like their own supercar showroom in their house. Each unit can hold between two and 11 cars, and there are three Deservators in total in the center of the tower. Wow. The name comes from the tower developer, Gil Deser, who partnered up with the iconic Porsche Design Group brand to create a 56-story luxury tower for the world's biggest car enthusiasts and billionaires alike with reports of Messi first buying an apartment in 2019. That is sick, bro. And apparently some clamps are gonna come out from underneath and carry me. Oh yeah, there it is. Oh wow. Stuff like this, I could watch stuff like this all day. I love this stuff. I amazing. I've never seen I've stuff I've never seen before. Says Lionel Messi. His Hold DNA on. might even be floating around. Maybe I can clone him, sell him to the Saudi league for a billion dollars, and then buy myself one of these apartments. Wow. Okay, so I'm fully closed in. The walls around me are glass, so I can actually see everything going on. And we're, we're up. That is so we're cool, we're bro. Imagine going, so like, <laughs> going, going home every night like that. That is sick. I would love it. Heck, I'll be yeah, sleeping, sleeping in the car, just having it go up and down all day. Just for that experience. And I feel like Tony Stark or Bruce Wayne. Let's see. Have we made it to my house? Wait. That is sick. That okay, so this is Supercar Blondie's video. It's just she has somebody else doing the tour. Okay. I was like, wait, am I? That's my living room. I gave credit to the wrong person, what? but no, it's Supercar Blondie. I mean, this is some next level Batman stuff. I mean, this is crazy. Yes, that is sick. Is the elite life. Wow. <laughs> that is cool, bro. Going home like that, honey. I'm home. Right. Coming up like it's this totally start. Is the billionaire life, and I don't want to get used to it, but let's take a little look around. The apartment that we're seeing now goes for about six point five million dollars. Hey, you don't have to be a billionaire, obviously. Oh, at the top, <clears throat> went for thirty five. I mean, it's probably easier when you're a billionaire, but four points. What was that? Four point five. By the way, this place has fifty six floors, and there's hundred and thirty two apartments. Most of them are already sold. 
The living room is spacious. Yeah, four point five million. Sweat, you know, obviously, is that to hang out. It's a lot of money, but I'm just saying. You know, they said billionaires so live there. It seems like you don't have to be a billionaire though to live there. I can't believe that you can literally have. You can fit your car. That is sick, like bro. A billionaire's dream come true, right? And to show off your cars, spacious kitchen. I would say it's kind of a small apartment. Maybe this is one of their small units. I would say the apartment looked kind of small for 4.5. Oh, my goodness. Look at that view. Oh, look at that view, bro. I'm about them views when it comes to where you live at. Oh, my goodness. I feel like just living here, you know, you're able to connect with other billionaires. Look, I mean, look, there's people up there on that balcony. That's not a cheap apartment either. So, over here, you got a pool. The pool's pretty big. Temperature isn't really... Designed for I want to jump in right now. It's kind of a windy day, but the view is insane. Steady Isles, look at the color of that water. A billionaire's privacy is the ultimate luxury, according to Gil Yeah, Lizard. yeah, that was a understandable. Huge point for the design of the tower. They can literally come inside and outside of their apartment, come and go without anybody talking to them. No paparazzi, no interaction, not at all. And what the and that's what they told want. Us is that people just enjoy having a little palace in the sky with their cars hanging out. We'll see if we if we delete this later, but um, apparently Maluma also lives here. So maybe there's gonna be like a little Maluma featuring Messi collaboration. It's an easy place to get a collab. Let's go inside. Over there, you got two elevators. I haven't been to Miami since, right since I was 16. I gotta go up there and visit. Also private. It's been a minute. I never gone as an adult. And this building cost $860 million to build. Desert Development is also working on something else, not with Porsche, but with Bentley. They're wow. a Bentley design building. They're saying that one's also going to be completely Oh, wait, it's a Bentley one too? Hold up. Billion dollars to build. Desert Development is also working on something else, not with Porsche, but with Bentley. They're oh, Bentley dang. Design. That's going to be sick. I got to go to Miami, bro. It's been insane. a long time. We're going to get our hands on that one too. And other celebrities like Future are already putting orders in for the Bentley Tower. The musician is in contract for a seven and a half million dollar three bedroom condo. The condo is gonna have space for four cars. Let's continue the tour. That's amazing. I, I can't get past like walking past. Yeah, the that is a car wow. In the, room in the sky, it's 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 nutty. All right, bedroom number one. First one we're gonna look at. This condo has three bedrooms across a three and a half thousand foot interior. And the first bedroom has loads of light coming in with an amazing view of Miami. The second bedroom is all the way at the end and of course has floor to ceiling windows with another view. And things look Wow, bro, you can put the like seat right there. Oh my goodness. I hope the windows on the outside you can't see on the inside. Like, because obviously you can look outside and you're right next to a building. I wouldn't like that unless your windows outside, they, whoever's on the other side can't see you. Are you guys ready to see the master bedroom? Of your sky palace. Yes, let me see it. Let me see it. But yeah, hopefully the window there is not see. You can't see from the outside. It's nice and clean, bro. I love just the plain white with some other color touches. That's nice. Lost asleep. You look at the size. My style. Awesome natural light. What's cool is that this room has direct access to the balcony too. There you go. And literally, fifty percent of the walls are windows. You get amazing, amazing views. Well, oh, it looks right. like you can see through the window. Maybe it's that other building, that. but hopefully it's not the same for Central theirs. The but you see right here, windows. You get You can see the TV from that room through there. I I wouldn't like that. I ain't gonna front. If I'm gonna get a place like this, if I was messy, for example. I will hope the windows is not see-through, or I need a view that doesn't look at the building. I don't know. It's just, I mean, or I mean, I could put some curtains up, but four point five. Right. <laughs> you know, I want, I want it the way I want. Well, the bathtub is probably the center of attention until you get near the Japanese toilet. This is very All nice, though. I mean, this is, this is, this is, this is what I want. I mean, this is like you, know, you touch the seats; it's already warmed. Two shower heads. And they got the benches going on too. Bentley and Porsche towers aren't all. Desert also has an Armani tower, literally a couple hundred meters wow. away, where soccer players like Radamel Falcao is rumored to have a place. Also, one more thing to note: this elevator that we just rode on 
is patented. So you're not gonna see this anywhere else. This is exclusive to Desert Development. They did this hmm. specifically for this building. They're gonna do it again in the future, maybe with the Bentley one. It's even got water sprinklers. So if your car catches on fire for any reason, sprinklers come on. I think it's awesome. You're not gonna find this anywhere That's else. That's sick, so, bro. What do you guys think of this building? What do you guys think? Amazing, amazing. Yeah, I gotta go to uh, Miami, bro. That's, <laughs> like I said, I haven't been there since I was 16. That's almost 20 years ago. I'm 33 right now. So yeah, let me know what y'all thought in the comments below. I love looking at stuff like this. It's possible, y'all. It's possible to live like you don't have to be a professional soccer player. How to get there? I have no idea. You gotta ask God, not me. Uh, I would love to get there too. So, but that's still cool. Shout out to them to have it. Like I'm, I don't play that jealous role. I'm actually happy for them, and it's motivation for me. And just for sites alone, that's amazing to see. But anyway, let me know what y'all thought in the comments below. And yeah, I'll see you later. I'll put the original video in the uh, description.